Hi guys, Paul here, and I've got another review for you guys. And this is going to be on a couple of microphones that were sent out for review for the GoPro Hero 3, 3 Plus, 4, etc. range of cameras. So anything from the 3 onwards, uh, these microphones will actually work for. So those of you guys that have actually flown with us would know that most of our video is actually done with the GoPro Hero cameras. That includes the aerial footage and also the ground footage that we record only because the GoPro Hero range of cameras are small they're compact and also obviously convenient to carry around with us so hence that's why we tend to use GoPros more than anything else occasionally I still use my iPhone for ground footage but 99% of the footage that you see from our channel is basically uh, done using a GoPro so this is the first mic we'll look at and this guy replaces your onboard uh, microphone so once you plug it in this mic will actually take over and it sits towards the side of your GoPro and uh, obviously designed to record ambient sound etc. Um, I suppose if you're walking with the camera it would obviously pick up your audio etc. So um, it, this is capturing audio close to the camera itself. Microphone build quality looks really really good it's just a matter of actually getting this guy on a GoPro and seeing exactly what it sounds like. So the second mic we're going to have a look at is the lavalier mic and it comes with its own little carry case which is handy. I've also got one of these carry cases on my road mics. Uh, this is the uh, dead cat and this will basically be used in windy environments, obviously outdoors. This is the microphone, um, USB connector as you can see. It's a micro USB that will plug into the side of your GoPro. Uh, there you go. And let's get this guy off so you can see the actual microphone itself. Now the microphone build quality looks quite reasonable. Uh, the clip is actually a metal clip, so that's really good. Uh, it's not going to be breaking like some of the plastic clips that you get on the cheaper lavalier mics. Get this guy back on there. And we'll get the dead cat on so you can see what it looks like with the dead cat. It's pretty easy to put this guy on. Uh, like I said, you're only going to use this uh, essentially outdoors. So that's pretty much what the mic looks like. It's just a matter of now getting this onto a GoPro and seeing exactly what it sounds like. Uh, what we're going to be doing is running some indoor audio uh, and this will be Thomas uh, doing a voiceover. So it'll give you a good indication of what uh, voice sounds like, if there's any hiss in the background, etc. The only thing I'll be tweaking here is the levels. Um, this is the level of the onboard mic, the level of the uh, add-on microphone and obviously this lavalier mic. Uh, so they sound about the same volume level, uh, but I won't be adjusting the audio other than that and it'll give you an idea exactly what the different microphones actually sound like. Anyway, what we'll do now is cut to Thomas doing some voiceover work. Here in my garage, just bought this new uh, alien here. It's fun to fly up here in the Melbourneian parks. But do you know what I like a lot more than materialistic things? Knowledge. In fact, I'm a lot more proud of these uh, three boxes that I had to get installed to hold the 2,000 new props that I bought. It's like the Drone National Champion had no access. The more you learn, the more you earn. Now, maybe you've seen my GMAC talk where I talk about how I fly pack a day. Now, I don't fly pack a day to show off. It's again about the knowledge. And in fact, the real reason I keep this alien here is that it's a reminder. A reminder that dreams are still possible. So anyway guys, I really hope you enjoyed this audio test that was completely unrelated to Ty Lopez and we'll see you in the next one. Okay, this will be another test. We've got him closer to the mic, so he's actually closer to this mic. I'm going to see exactly how we go with the audio with this take. Yes. Now, with the other take, that was all I could remember. We actually created a full transcript for the whole thing, but um, it's too much for me to remember. So this will be a nice lengthy talking so we get a good idea of what the audio sounds like. So, yeah. Uh, it's going to be a bit more choppy too because I'm going to be reading a lot of this so rather than saying. Default audio from uh, GoPro. That'll be the one running that omnidirectional mic and one that he's got the uh, tie clip mic and he's got a GoPro in his pocket there somewhere. Yes. That's a lot okay. of GoPro per GoPro. Go for it. Do the read. Yep. So this is going to be mainly me reading, not actually Go for it. remembering. Anyway. Here in my garage, just bought this new uh, alien here. It's fun to fly up here in the Melbourneian parks. But do you know what I like a lot more than materialistic things? Knowledge. In fact, I'm a lot more proud of these new storage boxes that I had to get installed to hold the 2,000 new props that I bought. It's like the US Drone National Champion Chad Noack says, the more you learn, the more you earn. Now, 
Maybe you see my GMAT talk where I talk about how I fly pack a day. Now you know, I fly pack a day not to show off. It's again about the knowledge. And in fact, the real reason I keep this alien here is that it's a reminder, a reminder that dreams are still possible. Because it wasn't that long ago that I was in a little suburb in Melbourne, sleeping in my bed in a home with only my dad's money as my bank account. I was too young for a college degree. I had no propellers. But you know what? Something happened that changed my life. I bumped into a mentor and another mentor and a few more mentors. I found five mentors and they showed me what they did to become the fastest racers. Again, it's not just about the flight, it's about the good flight, acro, racing and proximity. And so I record a little video, it's actually on my website, you can click here on this video and it'll take you to my website where I share three things that they taught me. Three things that you can implement today, no matter where you are. Now, this isn't a get fast quick scheme, you know, like they say if things aren't too good to be true, they are too good to be true. I'm not promising you that tomorrow you're going to be able to go out and fly an alien, but what I am telling you is that it can happen faster than you think if you know the proven steps. So I record a little, vid little two minute video on my website, like I said, it's not the most professional, I just shot it here with my dad's iPhone, but it's real. Nobody can argue, this is my true story. And I'm going to give you the three most important things that you can do today. So click the link, go there, it's completely free to watch, it's just a couple of minutes. Invest in yourself, always be curious, don't be a cynic. Okay, people see videos and they say, ah, that's not real, that's for somebody else. Don't listen, don't listen. Be an optimist. Like Boris B, the man who developed Betaflight, he said that he was only 15 years old when he read a forum post by Metal Danny. And that post changed his life. Forum posts can change your life. And in that forum post, Metal Danny said, propellers. So if you're a cynic, if you're a pessimist, you don't need to click here. Don't worry about it, I don't need to talk to everybody. But if you're somebody who knows that there's something better, because a dream is possible, you know. For some of you, maybe it's not necessarily an, uh, an alien. Maybe it's a new GoPro, a new opportunity, designing your own multi-rotor. Maybe it's a new flight style without so much stress, traveling the world, doing those things you know you're destined to do. You, can, you can't do those things unless you understand spare parts. Propellers. I don't call it propellers anymore, I call it fuel units. You must have enough fuel units to live out your dream and live out your destiny. So I'll see on my website, it's a quick video and you'll see there it's absolutely free. So just click this video and you'll be taken there in a second and um, I'm excited to share this amazing stuff. You'll see, not because of everything. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't do that that long. Oh, okay. No. I'm going to continue now. I'm excited to share this amazing stuff. You'll see, not because of anything of me, but because I've been fortunate enough to learn from mentors many years ahead of me. Not just in forum posts, these, although I love posts, also real in-person mentors. So let me share with you these three tips that have made all the difference in my life. They're practical, you can do them today, you can start them, you can start on them today, alright? See you there on my website. Thanks for watching guys. See ya. Hope you enjoyed the audio test.